Barack Obama got some really bad news about being found guilty of this crime. Former President Barack Obama was neck deep in the worst scandal in American political history, but Obama believed he would get away with his role in the conspiracy to bring down Donald Trump. But Barack Obama just got some really bad news about being found guilty of this crime. Over the weekend, Donald Trump announced Director of National Intelligence Dan Coats would step down as the president would nominate Texas Congressman John Ratcliffe to replace him. I am pleased to announce that highly respected Congressman John Ratcliffe of Texas will be nominated by me to be the Director of National Intelligence. A former U.S. attorney, John will lead and inspire greatness for the country he loves. Dan Coats, the current director, will be leaving office on August the 15th. I would like to thank Dan for his great service to our country. The acting director will be named shortly, the president tweeted. Dan Coats was a deep state stooge that undermined the president at every turn by parroting the talking points of the failed Washington status quo. Ratcliffe, on the other hand, used his time on the House Judiciary and Intelligence Committee to expose the wrongdoing of the Obama deep state in the Russian collusion hoax. The day before President Trump officially nominated Ratcliffe, the Texas congressman appeared on Maria Bartiromo's Sunday Morning Futures program on Fox News. Ratcliffe stated that there were crimes committed by the Obama administration and that Attorney General William Barr would bring these lawbreakers to justice. What I do know as a former federal prosecutor is that it does appear that there were crimes committed during the Obama administration, Ratcliffe told Bartiromo. The only place we can get the answers is from the Justice Department right now. The American people want that. Their faith and trust has been shaken in our Justice Department, and the only way to get that back is for there to be a real accountability with a very fair process. Again, I have supreme confidence in Bill Barr's ability to deliver that, and at the end of the day, wherever the outcome may be, as long as we know that the process was fair, the evaluation was fair, justice will be done," Radcliffe concluded. This is not what Obama and his deep state pals wanted to hear. For the first two years of the Trump administration, deep state apologists like former Attorney General Jeff Sessions and Dan Coats kept their thumbs down on any investigations into the clear criminal wrongdoing committed by rogue Obama deep state agents. The FBI lied to FISA judges and anti-Trump forces in the intelligence community illegally leaked classified information, yet no one was held accountable. That all appears to be changing. Attorney General William Barr is investigating the origins of the Russian collusion hoax and Congressman Ratcliffe could prove to be a valuable ally as the Director of National Intelligence. Ratcliffe's confirmation to this position would also send a message to the leakers and saboteurs still in the government that their day is over.